Hello and welcome to the Generational Gamer. Today we are going to play with this controller on the Super NT. This is, in fact, the original SNES. Well, I'm sorry. It's for the original SNES. Oop, I just dropped. I'm starting to drop crap already. And I am going to test on a game I have not played in some time. So let's give it a whirl now, shall we? Let's see if uh, my stuff went out to the land of Twitter world. And hopefully it has. Yay, it has. All right. Now I'm going to start this game out fresh. Let me... So if you watch this in rewind, let me just give you my impressions about this controller. It damn near, damn near feels original. That it feels damn near the original quality of the original SNES controller. In fact, I'd venture to say I like it better than this bad boy, which is the official licensed Switch controller. But then again, I've been a huge fan of 8-bit Do for some time, so let's give it a whirl and ask any questions you like. Do I feel lag? Do I feel bloated? Whatever. So no data because I haven't played this game in years, and I don't even remember the controls. Let's see, so shot. Oh shit, we gotta change that. That's gotta be Y. Jump has gotta be B. Dash is A. Item cancel. Angle up. Angle down. Yeah, that's about what I normally make it. So welcome to whoever's on stream with me. I appreciate the views. In fact, let me do this just because I like to start off this way, and do a friendly reminder. Come on now. Help me out. Alright. Moving right along. Watch this. I'm going to hit start and something's going to happen. Boop. Look at that. No lag. The last Metroid is in captivity. The galaxy is at peace. The galaxy is at peace. Woohoo! I love this music. I'm going to shut up. Okay, yeah, my microphone's working again. I turned it off for a second because I was a dumbass. So those who don't know, this is the ending of Metroid 2, which is now available on the 3 slash 2DS. She did a bang up job too, didn't she? I have not yet charged this. It actually came pre-charged. Yay!
Now you can't really screw this part up. The graphics are so much better than uh, what we had in the original Metroid. Does anybody have any questions? Oh, there's all the dead people. And that's on a Nintendo game of the 90s. 1994, I was in high school and I played the hell out of this when girls weren't interested in me. There it is. There's my baby! There's my baby! Come here! It's Ridley! Now you can't die in this section, but you have to get down to like 20 energy. Yeah. Ah, she grabbed me. Get away from me, Ridley. Yep, and Ridley's gone with some nice Mode 7 effects. And now I gotta escape. Let me out! <laughs> Let my people go. Oh, I'm getting hit by stuff. That's not good. Yeah, you can't actually get damaged at this point. Come on, move. The time is your enemy on this one. But this is kind of cool. Once you get past this part, the the whole thing starts moving. Mode 7 blew away my teenage mind when this was new. I made it! I can't believe this is the last uh, game up until Metroid Prime. Planet Zebes, that sounds so familiar. It feels like I was just there in 1987. Because I was. The first game's too prehistoric for me. I can't even play that anymore. If you're interested in the origin story, play Zero Missions. It's updated with some quality of life things like in this game. Okay. So, if you want to save your game right here so you don't have to go through that intro again, just hit down and you'll get sucked into your ship and you'll be able to save your game. You'll also increase, you'll also automatically restore your life. Yay! Now I can tell you from what I do remember about the game, there's nothing you can get to at this point. You need the running power up and I don't remember what it's called to get there. Do 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 You can't get there yet either, you need bombs. I don't even have the morph ball yet. How did she lose that? Samus, you really need to pay better attention to stuff you acquire. I already know I have to go here. So we're going here. The beginning of the game's easy to remember, so this is the Torian. This is the part you escape in the original game. It looks pretty decrepit if you ask me. I guess I do remember something about this game. I like the bugs. And now we go down to the Brinstar. Had to make a quick change. All right, now the Morph Ball's back where you left it years ago. Thank goodness for that. Oh, 
Uh-oh. But see, look, you can shoot that now because you can kneel over a little bit. I don't remember if there's anything over here yet that I can actually get to. I think you need... Yeah, you need missiles. Oh, you can get here. Well, since I'm here, I might as well go in there, you know? Missiles! Well, hot damn! By the way, for the record, you could not do any of that crap when you were... when you were in the first game. How rude. So nothing's alive right now, and I think I'm st Oh no, more missiles. Yay, I have ten now! Hallelujah! Hallelujah! I bet you didn't think my voice could go that high. Oh, it can! Let's go get some bombs. Oh, and save the game again, of course. Now once I get out of the Brinstar and the Torian, everything's gonna be back to life. Bastards. It's alive! It's alive! If I remember right, there's actually uh, some, a trick or something over there. See, look! We got enemies now! Get some missiles back, get some energy. These enemies were annoying in the uh, Prime game. All these Chozo warriors. Dun 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 Now there's crap on the sides. At least you can jump pretty high. No, don't make me fall, you bastard. You rat bastard. I'm not going down there because down is just more work. Alright, we'll get that one. At least it's not that far. And now I'm back to full health. No lag felt at all. And I just happen to be quite a fan of this controller. And nobody's asked me a single thing. I feel horrible about that. I don't even have indigestion to talk about. Nobody's asking me anything. Get up there. Boom, boom, jump. I gotta play this on the uh, Switch because it's available on that now too. Dun 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 dun. One of these is a save. I just don't remember which one. I think it might be this one. Oh, need bombs for that. So as another old relic to the past, you gotta bomb every damn thing in this game. This is the. This is the save. Yay! It does not restore your life when you land here. If I remember correctly. Which I may or may not, I don't know. So start takes you in here. And this is the Crateria. Whatever, however you pronounce that. Oh, good lord. Why do kids feel the need to block people? They're friends, no less. So I'm already liking this more than the Bluetooth version, which I also have. Give me that. I need missiles, because there's a boss coming up, as I recall. It's not a real boss, it's just like a little mini boss, you know, whatever. Oh, no, 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 no. This is the map. Yay, I have map data. So this is the weapons I have right now, and unlike the previous game, this stacks. So as I get more, you can't see here, as I get more beams, those beams will provide me, like uh, once I get the charge beam, it'll work with the regular beam. Once I get the, the wave beam, it'll work with the regular and the charge beam, and when you get the 
I forgot what it's called. But anyway, everything stacks in this game as opposed to the previous ones. Oh, we're going to use a missile on that bastard. Rather than fighting him. See, I'm back to full. Full, full, full. By the way, if you find me entertaining at all, this is the way I try to do all of my live whatevers. Where the hell am I? I need to go into this one now. I don't have the bombs yet, so I need to get the bombs. So, hit that subscribe button, I beg of you. I do like to entertain, so hopefully I can do that for you if you're watching this today. Alright, let's see. Oh yeah, we just gotta go down here. Boop. There's something over here too. Oh no, you need the bombs to get out of that. Here's the little mini boss. After I get through this crap. Boom! Here's where the bombs are, folks. So it looks like just a regular old pickup. Okay, cool. But it's not. Surprise! That thing wakes up. I don't remember how the hell to beat it. Oh, you just... Go underneath it. Gotcha. Oh, shite. Oh, I beat it. Woohoo! Oh, no, I didn't. Now it just looks pissed. And I'm dying. Shite. Don't die on me. All right, there we go. Please have life. I need to make it back to that save. There we go. And now I got bombs. Just for shits and giggles, let's see. Bomb everything. You never know if there's a secret. I don't think there is one in here, but you never know. Very creepy music. Bomb. Alright, let's go save our game since I don't want to die and lose that all that I have achieved. Get down there, you bastard. There you go. I forgot how much fun this game is. Alright, where have I not been? Oh, I gotta go down here. You bastard. Alright, let's see what we get over here. Oh, missiles. Alright, I'll take that as nothing there. What do y'all think? Good? Good. Ah, damn it. Get back up there. Have I been everywhere in this section yet? Hi, George. It looks like I have. 
Alright, we're gonna save before we go someplace new. I know, I keep going back here, but I don't want to go repeat anything. Who wants to reinvent the wheel, you know? Oh, for the record, this right here is the Bluetooth one, okay? I have tried pairing it with this. I have not been able to get it to work. I have. I may have to update this one, but it, I can get the PlayStation 4 controller to work without any problem on it. But then you're still using Bluetooth as opposed to 2.4 gigahertz. And we all know la no lag is better. Ah, dang it. Now that has nothing to do with the controller I bought with my own money. That has to do with the fact I suck at games now. Which is why I play the old games. Ah, you suck. Get out of my way. Get out of my way. Ooh, an energy tank. I needed one of those. So one of my pet peeves with the original game, you wanted to save the energy tank right near the start of the game. What the hell? Oh, you gotta... I gotta bomb this asshole? Alright, screw it. I'll just missile you. Um, because if you didn't, you had to grind for the whole beginning of the game. It was so annoying. I think this is a boss. Oh, no, this is the equivalent of the Torian. So after you hit... After the eyes go out of every one of them that you beat... So that's good to know. It would be really cool, though, if they if this game had the option to mark things that you wanted to come back to. Because I know damn well I'm going to have to... Hey, Mike Garvey, how you doing, my friend? Oh, you can't kill those ones yet. Oh, dang it. They made a GBA remake? Not on this game. That was, um, Metroid Fusion. No, this is the original one on the Super NT. This is the original Super Metroid. Now, you can play it on the Switch if you have Nintendo Switch Online. It's part of that. It's also on the, NE on the SNES Classic. Dang it. Well. Let's see what we got here. I can't get in there yet, but this is an excellent place to grind, see? No, Metroid Zero Mission is the remake of the first game. And I was talking about that a little bit earlier. That game's awesome. I prefer it over the original. The original is just way too rough. Even for my retro needs. Oh shit. Or we, we're just gonna bomb uh, missile this dude. Alright. Like I said, bomb everything. Ooh, energy. Or map, I don't know. Map data. Yep, I needed that. Cool, there's a save directly underneath me. I need that too. No worries, sir. By the way, I hope you're I hope I'm successfully entertaining you all. I do what I can. So here should be the the save. Pete never got this far? This is the beginning of the game. What the freak? By the way, I'm trying on this one a dirt cheap 
capture device, and I think it looks phenomenal. The reason I'm trying it is because I bought another one just like it for my side-by-sides. This way everything will be completely equal. Rather than using a high-end one on one place, but a cheap one on the other. So, let's see, I think you gotta run right here. Nope, can't make it yet. But I got that, so we're good. Yay, more missiles. I have beaten this game so many times. But it's been years since I beat it on an original or nearly original console. There we go. I got all my missiles back. Pete should be watching this. He can learn. Learn. Yes, I'm saving again. I do the same thing in Castlevania Symphony of the Night. Damn, this game is fun. I completely forgot about this. I have not played it in so long. Alright, let's see. Where do we have to go? So that looks like a power-up or a boss. So let's go there first. Get that knocked out of the map. Oh, shite. Get up there. I need that. Yay, I'm back to full health. Ish. Got it. Alright, now I got no lights again. Oh, get over there. Let's see what we get here. Missile refill. Yay. Alright, just for shits and giggles, let's see if there's anything over here that I am missing. So there's something over there, if I can get to it. I need, I need a suit to get there. I'm not going to risk it. So later in the game you get the space jump, and then at that point you can go pretty much anywhere. Where the hell? There we go. I might it! Hey, hey! How are your diagonals? Okay, fine. I'm not noticing anything. I think this is a... Yeah, it's a super bomb. This is with uh, with the new one, the one that just came out. I haven't noticed any problems. So this is the official Switch version. And you can see it's got all those fancy uh, extra buttons for the Switch. By the way, if you play Cuphead, I highly recommend this one. Or this one. This one's really good, too. But use the D-pad. The cool thing with this one, and I know I'm completely off-topic, is that any game that supports a D-pad works with this. Up to and including Mario Kart. Remember those days. Uh, my diagonals seem fine. Your upright it tends to be a little... Yeah, I, I'm, I'm doing it right now. No issues. Gotcha. <laughs> Alright, we're not going to waste the energy trying to... Oh. Gotcha. Bomb. 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 So I'm still playing Ghost of Tsushima. Game's a lot of fun. I'm horrible at it. Oh, hold on, let me read what you got. You know what? I might have to try Street Fighter on this thing. I haven't played it. So this right here, you need to have the high speed things. See? So you gotta run really fast. That section is such a huge pain in the ass. Unless you have the space jump. 
I have not really broken mine in. I haven't played with it all that much. I played with it a couple times uh, when I first got it, and I'm playing. I've played with it a little bit after that, but I got Ghost of Tsushima around the same time, and I've been playing that predominantly. But it feels exactly like the other one I had, and that's and that's really what I'm basing it on. I have the Bluetooth version. And it feels fine. Nothing? I know there's something right here. Oh shoot, I wasted a missile. I got myself a save! Let's turn that off. It's a waste of energy. A waste indeed. So how's everybody doing today? The stream's not hopping too much, but it is early in the day, and I'm not going there yet. There's too much to do here. Get back here. Okay, cool. I'm back to full health. Let's see what we got over here. I'm cer almost certain there's something over here. I don't think I can Actually, I may not be able to get here yet. This is gated off because you need the either the space jump or the the what you were thingy. Oh. Okay, that needs a super missile. Can't get that yet. Refill my energy. Let's kill this bastard. Get over here. Gotcha. Give me back my missile. Asshole. Ooh, more missiles. Yay! If I remember correctly, this requires those zip things to run across. Let's see. Again, bomb everything. Oh no! You can just go. Cool. What's this? The charge beam! Finally, a good weapon! How the hell do you get out of this? Let's see what we got over here. Something I can't go to yet because I need the super missile. I love how Nintendo describes things. It's either a regular missile or it's a super missile. Let's restore my life. Come on, grind me, baby. Oh, that might actually be the super bomb. Damn my horrible memory. I don't feel like fighting that asshole again. Because he's just gonna respawn. I'm not interested in wasting my time redoing the same thing over and over again. Gotcha. Let's restore my life with full health. I mean, my uh, save my game with full health. There we go. By the way, anybody interested in buying an aftermarket Super Nintendo, I highly recommend the Super NT. It's a little pricey, and if you plan on buying the the uh, the Genesis version, buy it at the same time because shipping is a bitch. It's like twenty dollars for shipping on this damn thing. It's ridiculous. It's like it's coming directly from China. Oh, you fucker! Get over here. I know I shouldn't use such profanity. All right, well, I can only go one place. Oh, let's see what's over here. All right, guess I'm going up. Boom. Oh, it's a boss. Oh, no. 
Oh yeah, it is the boss. Let's see. Oh damn, I'm sucking at this already. You gotta wait for it to open itself up. There we go. Gotcha. Hey, I still remember this. I still remember this just the way that I am. I don't know why I'm singing. I only got eight missiles left. I better beat him. He's just bouncing around like a cocker spaniel. Alright, finish bouncing. I got shit to do. I'm trying to save the world, damn it. Completely safe right here, by the way. As long as I turn into a ball. How the hell did they get that in into this game, too? But it's a trope in Metroid now, so... You're always turning into a ball. Beat it! Now I get all my shut back. And I get super missiles. And I can jump on it now, too. Woohoo! So I can either go back the way I came, or go up. Let's go up. Shall we? So if you jump and then you land, you can do the wall jump. And it is just a huge pine in the arse. So I don't recommend trying it. Oh no, I didn't get the super missile. I have to go forward. Let's restore some life and get some crap back. Come on, I'm almost there. Dan 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 Oh no! That can't be supposed to happen. It's not supposed to happen. Super missile! Woohoo! By the way, if you don't mind hitting that subscribe button and like, 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 like. I like to entertain people, so hopefully I'm doing just that. Get away from me, birds. I made it through! Ha 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 ha. Oh damn, you need a super missile for that. Son of a bitch. Where are we now? Over here? Alright, let's go save the game before we save any more of the world. So green is super missile. I've got almost everything. Got him. Ha ha. You dead. I might as well restore stuff beforehand. Is that all? I guess you only get two super missiles. Okay, that's fine. Boom. Now, Jinx, is that how you pronounce your name? I did just notice when I pressed up, it was a little stiff. But so far, other than that, it's, it's great. I love these controllers. Yo, Willie Brooks, welcome. I 
I am not using an original SNES, although I do still have my original SNES. This is an analog Super NT. Eh, get away from me. I'm gonna kill you. There you go. I kill you! Okay, so you and I are experiencing the same thing. Um, I don't really think it's all that bad. I'm not really concerned about it. But it's just an observation. I mean, this is a kind of a fast action-based game, so... If it's fine on this for me, I'm not really too concerned about it, you know? Honestly, I don't think I'm doing too bad for a game that I haven't played in all this in all this time, you know? Where the hell do I need to go? I need to go down. Jump. Up and right. Not seeing that. Hold on, let me read what you're writing, Jinx. Am I pronouncing your name right? I don't know. I might have to take it apart and take a look at it, you know? Like I said, it, it, this, it's pretty minor on mine. I mean, I wouldn't, I wouldn't trash the controller over it, metaphorically at all, you know? It's still it's such a minor issue on for what I'm experiencing. Ah, screw it. I'm gonna kill you too, like this. Hey, <laughs> hey. You know I would yell at my son for doing that. Pronunciation is spot on. Hallelujah. Oh, not an issue the types of games I play the most. What kind of games do you play the most? Alright, so I gotta run up there. This was a nice introduction to the feature, having to run. Alright, I'm in a new area. Can't go up yet, so I guess I have to go down. Oh, RPGs and platformers. Okay, so what is it? What, what does this game fall into as far as? Because it's got it's like a platformer with RPG elements. By the way, how's my audio? Is it too loud? Am I too loud? Or because I I am kind of loud in general. Oh, get off of me, damn Metroid-like thing. There we go. I killed it. Oh, I need a super bomb. Alright, I need to go somewhere that I'm obviously not hitting. Wow, I a part I don't remember of this game. I turned the game audio a little bit down so I would be here so you could hear me. Alright, I gotta figure this out. Anybody remember how to get past this part? Oh, you just shoot it. Well, shit. <laughs> I'm glad I asked. Alright, so I'm guessing this is a save. I'm hoping it's a save. Because I am so much further away. It's an energy restoration. Well, hell's bells, we needed that. I can turn the game up a little bit. Hold on. Let me figure out where the game audio is. How about now? How's the game audio? Alright, so you still- I still don't have the aquatic suit. I forgot what it's called. I 
one back over here. Ah, screw it. Oh, dang. Alright, can I get up there? I can! I sense a secret. Or maybe not. I think this is where you drop down. Alright, cool. Glad to hear it. And honestly, I don't stream a whole lot, so it's nice to know. I started streaming more. So, in this section, this is a really nice effect. If you haven't played the game ever, or if you've never played it, if you haven't played it in a while or never got up to this point, in this very section, you use a power bomb, it blows it up, and then you're able to access this area. It links it all together. It's a really nice touch. It was one of those, oh my god, that's awesome moments back in 1994. Okay, so that's the... I might as well get it now. What the hell? Can I get... Oh, that's the... That's the boss. I can't get there yet. Oh, I can. I just don't want to. I don't even know what those games are. Do you have... Have you tried um, the save states on that? A dude on uh, Twitter, he's a he's a uh, speedrunner, I forgot his name. It was on Retro RGB as well, um, where, am I able to get over here? Uh, can't get over there yet. Um, anyway, where you, he, he created an operating system hack for it, where you can use, um, where you can use save states on it. Okay, can't go there yet. Yeah, I haven't messed with it. Okay, so I can't get there yet. So obviously I need the Varia. Please be a save. Nope, just an energy tank. Ah, oh, that'll work for now. I don't know if they work together. I only know from what I read. Oh, crappy A. Ah, what the hell, let's go here. I obviously can't get up there yet, so hopefully something's over here that I can use. Oh, well that's handy. Jump boots! Well, ain't that, ain't that handy? Yep, I can jump so far. Oh, that's sweet. I didn't know that. Look at this. I am packing in the missiles here. Yeah, I know who you're talking about. I've seen his stuff. What am I missing here? I think I gotta kill that guy. Nada. There we go. It's not worth the squeeze to get back to that. Now let's see what we got in here. Save. That's what I'm talking about. Yes, I would like to save. So Jinx, are you a subscriber? If not, would you mind considering it? What do we got here? Ooh, crap. Okay, so you need to be a runner. Nice. Yeah, I just saw it come through. Hallelujah! Thank you kindly. Xenaxia. Xenaxia. Is that correct? Pronunciation right?
By the way, hello. Sweet. Alright, I obviously can't go that way. An English translation of what? Alright, so can we all agree that retro games are, where, are, are far better than modern games? <laughs> kind of contact. Um, it's predominantly retro games, but it's modern tech for retro games. That is my focus. I'm gonna save again since I just got everything. I'm gonna have to check that out. It'll be in the stream, so that's good. I did recently do a video of um, Ghost of Tsushima because I just like the game. And I did a parody video because, you know, there was a huge controversy over over the fact that it was made by a Western developer. Can't type. That's fine. Nobody's criticizing. Anyway, so with Ghost of Tsushima, there was a controversy about the about the game being made by Western developers, and it sounded so familiar. In fact, let me um, let me link to it real fast. Put the link in here. See if you all find it funny. Um, I was interviewing my buddy who knew nothing about the Intellivision Amico, and I said to him, and we were talking a little bit about something. Anyway. Um, I told him, I happened to see him earlier in the day, and I had told him that I bought Ghost of Tsushima out of spite because people were complaining about it being made by Western developers. Anyway, so I ended up adding in a few things. So take a look at that and see what you think. I try to make people laugh. That's my goal. If it works, great. If it doesn't work, sorry. <laughs> but I do like to make people laugh. I, you know what, Jinx? I really did enjoy the uh, SNES in its day. But you know what? I have noticed since I got the SNES Classic... Oh, I don't need to do that. I can sit right here and do this. Jump. Since I got the SNES Classic, I actually find myself more interested in Genesis games than, than these. Oh, I need that. Get away from me, dude. Good, glad you liked it. Oh, there there we go, there's the hole. I'm getting you, there we go. You're not getting away from me. Okay, so I've been playing this game since it was new. I had no idea if you were charging your beam and then you got down like that, you dropped five bombs. That is so cool. I have been playing this game for decades and did not know that. Okay, Sega Kid never had an SNES back in the day. <laughs> so, my, my history with console... Oh shoot, I'm wasting those things. My history with the consoles is... Um, Intellivision was my first. And that is the one that I played with my with my late grandmother. So I have a huge bias towards the Intellivision. Okay, so I have Smash Brothers and my son has Mario Maker. I don't play either of that much. I am terrible at Smash Brothers. In fact, I am terrible at most modern games. They're fun, don't get me wrong, they're fun. Alright, I don't know what it's trying to tell me to do. I gotta destroy something, clearly. I guess I'm going back up this way. It's almost as if it has a goal for me. Oh, 
What the deuce? Alright, there's something over there I have to get. I don't know what it is. That would be cool. Can you do that? Have you, are you, um... Can you beat him in, like, record time or something? With all the warps, I used to be able to beat Super Mario, so... Something is missing here. I don't know what it is. Alright, I'm drawing a damn blank. So where am I? I'm right there. I got this whole section I can't even go to. I gotta go down. That's my problem. I gotta go down. I gotta go back to that save. How'd you beat the new one in 30 minutes? I can't even get through the first few levels in that amount of time. But then again, I am terrible at that game, like I said. Okay, so there's something here. Huh. Okay, you see there's something right there. Let me go save again since I just... Oh, I'm wasting missiles. Practice each game, yes. Oh. Yes, I do want to save, even though I'm running out of stuff, dang it. Do you have a channel? And it, if so, what's it on? Is it on YouTube? Stream? What? Alright, there's got to be something over here, and I am just drawing a blank on it. Do you have to use a super missile for something here? There's gotta be something. I haven't noticed any. I am not particularly susceptible to lag, though. I'm one of those people who just kind of... Yeah, I get used to it. Alright, there's gotta be something over here. Oh, you know what? Look at that. Screw this. We're just going to use missiles. Oh, this is Kraid. I need some weaponry. Dang. Oh, I needed that. Woo! Now I need some energy. Okay, cool. This is what I need. Come on. You see me sweating? <laughs> I do that naturally. So this is the last of the games that I remember you didn't have to beat a boss to get your weapon upgrades. You just organically found them. And the game locked you away from anywhere until you could get them. Oh, shite. Bad guy. Oh, I gotta use a missile to get through that. Now I'm at Kraid. Kraid! Yeah, I know. I'm getting there. I'm working on it.
So one of the benefits of uh, getting to a thousand subscribers, I tend not to use the word sub. I mean, there's nothing wrong with it per se, but I don't particularly use it. And the reason is, the benefit is uh, that since, if you, since you can monetize, you have the ability to be seen better. Ooh, crap. Okay, so I need to get up there. Damn! Get back up there! Oh, I'm not doing so well. I gotta go... Oh, shite. I gotta go get some weaponry now. Come on now. Dang! Yeah, now I'm sweating. Come on, open that big trap of yours. I think I got it. I think I got it. Maybe. Oh, that was easy. Then I remember. I only almost died a few times. Take that, Craid. Craid. Let's see what we got. Let me read whatever. Luck of your channel pops up on my feed regularly. That's good. That well, I appreciate you doing that. Varius suit. Now I can get through the hot spot. See, look, now you've got the uh, arm, the, the shoulder mount things. I don't think there's anything else in here. Alright, cool. Let's go back. Nothing in here. Let's run! So the next suit upgrade is the, whatever they call the water suit. I think there's something up there, I just don't remember what it is. I'm gonna have to check. Yep, I thought there was. Let's get more life first. Oop, that's not the way to do it. So who else on stream has this controller that I'm playing with? 2.4 gigahertz. It should be lag free. Whether or not it is, it's an entirely different story. So I've got a Saturn controller I'm going to plug into my Genesis and Genesis Mini. That's coming. I think that should be here sometime early next week. Oh, I have over 10,000 views. I'm at 30-some 30, 30 thousand views. My biggest problem is getting subscribers. Oh, I just realized I have full health. What do we have here? Ooh, more energy. I just wasted my time. Look at that. <laughs> That was a complete waste of time. I completely forgot about it, but now I have this on the map telling me absolutely nothing. But let's go save our game again. Alright, I, I didn't see something. Jinx, I do who else? What are you talking about? Those guys are annoying. Oh, damn it, I just wasted a good one. 
Okay, yeah. I like it. I've always liked these controllers. Get off of me. Ah, screw it. We're just gonna use missiles. Look at that. I got rid of them. I did indeed. Alright, you wanna see another game? If I have it, I'll I'll put it in. Just let me know what you're interested in. Especially considering I just saved the game. Get off of me. Now I can get through there. Hells yeah. Let's see what kind of goodies behind this wall. Besides enemies. Ah, oh, get off of me, you sucker. Get off of me. There we go. Well, that was helpful. Well, hell's bells. I'm glad I did that one. <laughs> Whoopsie. I really want the wave beam. This one kind of sucks. Alright, so I got the Varia suit. I can go back. I'm actually kind of impressed. I've never charged this controller. Yay! Let's get some more stuff. Oh, that wasn't the way to do it. That's helpful. Alright, save is over here. I'm gonna have to move this one back into the rotation a bit more. Hello there, Terrence Balmacel. Uh, let me see if I can pronounce it. Bal Balmacita. Balmacita, is that right? Okay, I do have the Bluetooth edition, and if you stand by for two seconds, I will show them side by side. Hold on a second, okay? Oh, cool, I did pronounce it correctly. Okay, do you want me to go get it? It's just in the other room. Yes, no. All right, we'll just use this one as a gauge. So, as I was saying earlier, this is right here is the Optima... All right, we'll use this one. This one's for the Nintendo Switch. It's Bluetooth. Games are des designed with Bluetooth in mind. These games, these old games, were not. This is the receiver for it. It is considerably larger than the receiver for this one, which is fine because I don't really care about that. This is compatible with... I mean, I've played with the PS4 controller on it. It's fine. I have not noticed any lag. As I've said to a few other people who were on earlier, I have not. I am not particularly susceptible to lag. I'm one of those people It's like, yeah, I get used to it, and then I'm fine with it. The only thing that I and Jinxed have noticed on this is sometimes the up is a little weird. But I think that it's still not a big deal. I do like the controller. It came pre-charged. Um, it feels almost exactly like the original or the Switch counterpart. I'm a huge fan of it. I bought it myself. It was not sent to me for review. Um, actually, for that matter, all the 8-Bit Do controllers I've reviewed and done on this channel, I've purchased myself. So, um, I've been a huge fan of them. I have the, I have both of them on the SNES. I have the SNES Classic one. I have several, I have all of them available for the NES, except for, oh, I'm sorry, the modern one. 
So this is the Turbo Graphics Mini. Obviously, I have that one too. I need to clean this thing. It's looking a little dirty. I have the NES Classic and the NES game controllers, and the one for the Switch that have this formation, where you got the turbo buttons and then these. It doesn't have the the this the uh, well this formation. I also have this controller, which is what I use on my Switch when I'm in my well when I'm streaming with it. I don't do a whole lot of Switch streams, but when I do, I use this because it's in here, and it is just an incredibly con comfortable controller. This is the SN30 Pro Plus. All that being said, with the Genesis, I have the Bluetooth and the 2.4 gigahertz. Right off the bat, the 2.4 gigahertz is cheaper. You don't have to buy a receiver for it. I like that. Now I did because I thought Bluetooth was just the way to go and I didn't know much about the 2.4, but then I bought that and that's now the dominant one. Same deal with the retro bits. I have them for the Genesis. And I prefer the 2.4 over the Bluetooth because there's less lag. That's the only one I've noticed any kind of lag on. But then again, I don't play that as much. But it's an awesome controller nonetheless. So, what other questions can I answer? Do you want me to pick another game It's a little bit twitchier or what have you. I, I'm happy to try all kinds of new things. And answer whatever I can. Absolutely. Terrence, are you a subscriber? I even got your name right. Woohoo! Overall, awesome. Overall, I've been a huge fan of 8-Bit Do's controllers. And like I said, they've never sent me anything. So, I buy... I've pretty much bought all of them for consoles that I have. The one I would like to see... No, I even got the NES one, so... Uh, I guess I gotta go down. I guess I can't... You, you don't have a latch in this one where you can climb. Ooh, that isn't good. That little piece of energy is all I got. Yeah, I'm not gonna worth risk killing myself for a tiny piece of energy. Cool. Well, thank you very much. Oh, that is not good. Oh, dang. I cannot go in the fire, the best of my knowledge. The SN30... Pull the trigger, guys. I did buy the NES 2.4 gigahertz as well. They came the same day. I reviewed them the same day. I like both of them a lot. I'm going to do a review on that one, too. The only reason I did the SNES first is because, honestly, the uh, viewer count is higher. Alright, we're going this way. I don't know what's coming up. Ooh. If I remember correctly, yeah, the lava's rising. Get away from me. Get away from me! Ah, crap. Get over... Th I need to get a damn energy boost or I'm gonna die bad. Or something. I think the ice beam is around here. Let's see what's over here. Please be a save. Please be a save. Woohoo! Before I use that, let's see if there's any benefits here. So I have the link to my impressions, and I call them impressions, because it wasn't an all-out review. I prefer doing impression videos and then doing a, a live review on it so people can ask me questions. Um, but as far as the NES one, let me actually put the link to that one in since I happen to have it handy. 
Uh, I thought I had a handy. Alright. There's a direct link to it. It does not get as much love as this one. I don't know why. Oh crap. I don't think I want to go there. Let's go up there first. Can I get up there? No, I cannot. I guess I need the ice beam first. I'm pretty sure that's what I'm about to get. And here I fall. Alright. I needed some missiles. Alright, so what games have you all played that you enjoyed recently? I was talking about Ghost of Tsushima a little bit before. Okay, so I can go up there, go up there. Alright, clearly I gotta get up there. How the hell do I get up there? Without the ice beam. Is it over here somewhere? Okay. Gotcha. Gotcha. Okay. Well, let's see what's on this side first. Please be... Oh, that isn't what I want. Let's see what we got down here. Hope it's another save because I'm gonna need it soon. What the hell is this? I'm gonna restore my life while I'm here. Oh, let's see. Whatever little time I have mainly focused on games from my youth. You know what? I completely get that. Because you know how long it takes to play a modern game? I just got Ghost of Tsushima, and I am nowhere in the game either. It's fun. I like it a lot. Alright, so this is actually more of just a life restoration thing. Let's see, is there something down here? Nope, doesn't appear to have anything. Well, I guess we're going back this way now that I'm full of health. Alright, I guess we're going in this way. Okay, yep, the ice beam has to be around here. Because there's all kinds of things I can stand on after that. Damn. Get off of me. Come on, be the ice beam. Be the ice beam. Or at least have the ice beam nearby. Alright, let's go back because that's about to blow up on me. I needed some life. Obviously, I can't get there. Oh, can't get there yet either. I need the super bomb. Likewise. Hold on, let me read the rest of it. You too. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. I try to do streams. There, I'm, I'm very irregular with my schedule, and I know that hurts me, but... I also work full time, I have two little ones, and they're probably going to look for me soon, so I'm going to probably have to shut down in a bit. Oh. Oh, you know what? This is stupid. Let's go underneath them.
Alright, what the hell do you do here? Oh, I gotta have to climb on this dude. Oh, damn! Damn, get back up there. Woo! Oh, I see messages coming through. Yeah, cool, I'm glad you did. Oh, that one moves a lot faster. My reflexes just aren't what they were when I was a teenager. You too. Thank you, Terrence. Oh, I should not be wasting those. Please be a save. I'm doing well. Not even close. I'm not doing that right now. But that's a perfectly good sign to know to come back to it. Have any of you played the DS, uh, 2D, 3DS version of the game? Of the second one? I started, I haven't gotten very far in it though. What in the freaking hell is this? Alright, let's go back and see what it is. See what's up here. Maybe there's a save here. Oh, this is where I was before. No, this is new. Mm. I don't think this is too helpful for me, but this may be. I could use that. Restore some life. Please be a save. Damn! <laughs> Well, at least I'm someplace new. The running booster! I needed that. Alright. Let's see. Get up there. I made it! I made it, I made it, I made it, I made it. Come on. Ooh, that ain't good. Welcome to whoever joined. Where? Oh, there's a save right over there. Sweet. I don't know if I can even get to that. I can, but I'm not going back there again, clearly. Whew. All right, man, that was that was some hardcore stuff. That was fun. I appreciate everybody who came on here today and who joined me. Uh, I had fun. I hope you all did too. And let me just put this in here really fast while I'm saying my goodbyes. And after that, do my official goodbye. And like I said, I greatly appreciate anybody who stopped by. I appreciate being able to talk to people. It's nice talking to people who have seen me but never actually interfaced before. So with that being said, if you got this far, you probably like the video. Well, how about checking out some of these other ones? And if you like them too, please subscribe. Have a good one.